Fuck all these niggas and bitches, they dead to me. I got the sauce, I got the remedy. Say my dog, but act like an enemy. I make a call and turn you to Kennedy. I'm wasting my time, I'm wasting my energy. Shot for my confidence, shot for a better. Oh. The 2024 NBA playoffs are here, ladies and gentlemen. The play-in games are over. The NBA playoffs are set. We're going to get rock, rock and roll. We're going to get straight to all the action going on. Y'all going to hear my predictions. Y'all going to hear what's going on with these teams. Y'all going to hear these teams that's, that lost, what they got to do in the offseason. Y'all going to hear all that. So, in today's video, first, we're going to dive in into the Golden State Warriors. And what they have to do this offseason. <laughs> What's good, y'all? It's your boy. We're back again with another video. All right. So, in my reaction video, y'all know that which is going to be dropping tomorrow. Stay tuned for that. Okay. Go to my reaction channel. We'll chill, react, give you a little like, subscribe to the channel. Going to be dropping reactions every day, non stop. Okay. By all the playoff games. But, the Golden State Warriors are finished. No pun intended. We get it. They're, not, they, they're out of the playoffs. But they are finished as a duo. And I'm talking about particularly Steph Curry and Klay Thompson. Especially Klay Thompson. He's finished. It's unfortunate. He needs a new scenery. I still think he has a lot of game in him. No, yes, he has, he has fell off. Yes. It's proven that, obviously. You score zero points in a play-in game, that's pathetic. He's not, he's not 100% there. Okay? But as a whole team, they need to blow it up. I'm sorry. They do. The only person I would say is untouchable is definitely Steph Curry. Other than that, you need to blow the whole team up, in my opinion. Even Kaminga. And Kaminga is such a nice young player, but he's very inconsistent on the team. It's because that Steve Curry is limiting his minutes back and forth, right? But when he does let him play a lot, Kaminga doesn't, sometimes he doesn't show up. As for Andrew Wiggins, you got to let him go. You got to let him go. I know his issues off, off the court, but that's been long and gone. We, we got a lot of other players that got a lot of issues on on off the court. He's, he's just not himself no more. He's not Andrew Wiggins. It is what it is. Right, he's not the all star version. As for Draymond Green, we know all the incidents that's been happening all season long with him. He needs to go, also. He needs to go. I hate to say it, you know, Draymond has to go because how many chances can you give this man? You feel me now? Don't get it wrong, I'm a, I'm a. I would say I'm a definitely a I'm a definitely I'm a Draymond stan. I won't say I'm a fan fan, but I respect him. I respect him a lot. I love his podcast. I love how like his mindset of things and how he talks about the game is respectable and I acknowledge it and I admit it a lot. But when something's on a, when it comes on the court, when you keep getting these incidents. Back and forth, back and forth, and the coaches and the organization got to keep defending you. It comes a point in time where, especially Steph Curry, they're going to get tired of you. And they're not going to really trust you. And that's going to get in the team's chemistry aspect. That's going to get in the team's way. I think that alone has distracted the Golden State Warriors. That led to their inconsistent play. So I believe he needs another shooting himself. He needs to go. It is what it is. This is what I'm talking about blowing the whole thing up. You need to blow the whole thing up. 
for the Warriors. The only player is untouchable is Steph Curry. Now, Chris Paul. Let's be honest. He needs to retire. I said it. He needs to retire. I don't get what, like, okay. Great career. Hall of Famer. We get it. He needs to retire. Okay. And I don't think I don't know another team that could take him on right now. So we got him out the way. Okay, the young Sturbreds. Let's say Jackson Davis. Keep him. You let him develop more, right? Uh, the little guard, number two. I don't know how to pronounce his last name. Keep him. Let him develop more. And that's probably the only person you need to keep. Alongside Kaminga. Everybody else has to go. And I, I didn't even, we're not going to mention Curry again. We, I, I say what we need to say about Seth Curry. The Golden State Warriors needs to blow this thing up. This, is a good, this, this season was... A disaster in a lot of aspects. Yes, their record wasn't great, but I wouldn't say it as their play was a disaster. It's the distractions was the biggest disaster for the Golden State Warriors in this season. So the Golden State Warriors, y'all are finished as a whole dynasty, obviously, as the whole duel, as the Splash Bros, whatever you want to call them, it's over. It's a new. Gen of players coming in. It's over. The West is getting even deeper, right? More talent coming in. They, a lot of teams have figured out your play style. It's time for a change, Golden State. That's all I got to say for this video. If y'all enjoyed, give it a like, subscribe, chat if you're new. Comment down below what you think. It, 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 this is really over for Golden State Warriors. And comment down below what players they should get for Clay Thompson and Draymond Green. Without further ado. Till next time, it's me, Bo Will, and I'm out.